Cranial nerve 8, which is the acoustic nerve, mediates hearing and vestibular function. Because vestibular function is not routinely tested, our exam will focus on hearing. I'm going to, to assess hearing, occlude hearing. one of the patient's like ears with your finger, stand one to two feet away from the patient, and cover your mouth to prevent lip reading. Two, now four. test the open ear by softly whispering numbers or words. Gradually increase your voice volume until the Five, patient can identify nine. the spoken numbers or words. If hearing is diminished, test for lateralization by performing the Weber test. I'm going to, strike the to do this, place the base of a vibrating tuning fork firmly on top of the patient's head. Then ask if he hears the sound on one or both sides. Normally, the sound is heard midline or equally on both sides. Next, compare air and bone conduction by performing the RINA test. Place a lightly vibrating tuning fork on the mastoid bone behind the ear. When the patient indicates that the sound is no longer heard, quickly place the vibrating fork that. near the ear canal. Yes, Normally, the patient can hear the sound longer through air than through bone. Be sure to test the opposite ear. Yeah.